We are in the book of Revelation, and you may not have really dove into it and said, okay, I really want to read this. And sometimes that happens because we don't understand what is going on. So I'm going to challenge you today in a little bit different way, especially if you are someone who reads from a Bible that you've been told this is the only Bible you can read from, and yet you don't understand it when you read it. See, many times in our walk, we can't take the steps that we want to with God because when we read His Word, we don't understand it. And rather than turn to a version that we can understand, which would help us to turn back to that version and dive more into the Bible, we just quit. Or we just hope to hear from someone or we wait for someone to explain it to us. And God did not intend that for any one of us. So, understand this about the book of Revelation. This was written in such a way that only believers could understand it. And for us, the Bible, when we read it, only believers can truly understand it. Especially if we can read from a version such as the Message or NIV or NLT, a version that possibly we can understand a little better than maybe one that we've been given that we're like, eh, I'm not getting this. So when this letter was written, it was written in such a way that only a believer knew what was going on. Would you challenge yourself tonight to find a version of the Bible that you can read? Go to BibleGateway.com. You can pick a version in there. They've got hundreds of versions you can go and turn to and start to dive into this book of Revelation and see what it is that God will show you. And we'll pick up from there tomorrow.